cheese out of local certified organic milk and we pick it up on the day it's, it's milked so it comes straight from the cow, we pick it up in our little trailer and we bring it back and make beautiful cheese. But why we do it really is because we've both got a passion for cheese and a passion for um, making good food for people. We don't cool the milk, we don't store the milk, it just goes straight from the cow into our trailer, into our little pasteuriser vat. When it gets pasteurised, we add culture to it if we're doing a cultured um, aged cheese. And then we add rennet and then we cut it and then we get to the stirring phase, which is James is doing there. Then when it's reached the right consistency and the right acidity, we'll actually poop it into the mould and then it turns into cheese over a couple of days if it's a fresh cheese or, you know, a year if it's a, a little more aged cheese. We gently treat the milk and we make it on the day of milking and that gives it its particular flavour um, and gives it a strong, creamy taste, which is consistently what people at the markets comment. They say, oh, it's very creamy and we think it's that. Those simple things done really well. So some of the cheeses that we make would be ricotta, uh, we make quag, we have a feta, we do um, some mould ripened cheeses, as in a brie or a camembert. Uh, some of our cheeses we age a little bit longer, like our hartia or our parihaka. So our hartia is based on an English red leicester and it's becoming more and more popular and as it ages it just gets better and better. Our parihaka is based on a Romano style of cheese out of Italy, so that's got the flavour a little bit of Parmesan, but it's sweet and has a nice long finish, and that's been very popular. Uh, the grinning gecko comes from the common green gecko that we get in our tea tree at Whangarei Heads. We're getting more bird life, more kiwis, and consequently more geckos, and Catherine thought that they must be pretty happy about that, and consequently, Running gecko because they're not being eaten. <laughs>